Mm, yeah. Uh, no, no, no. Yeah, yeah. That, that, that's right. Okay. Uh, all right. That's good. Wait. Is that thing on? Hello. The atomic number of carbon is 12. But enough about me. What about Stomp? Since 2006, this so-called citizen journalism website has been generating a lot of hate, most recently for this photo. It inspired petitions like these to take the site down, and led to reactions like this. I think it was stupid to, to take a picture of someone who is sitting down basically, that person, you know, maybe he's tired. I'm sorry, it's so stupid! <laughs> uh, well, we conducted some citizen journalism of our own to find out why people hate Stomp so much. To me, uh, my impression is that majority is uh, not necessary. Uh. It's bringing quite a lot of negativity to our, our society right now. Often, it is very ridiculous. Well, it's the, the response is very exaggerated from the, from the Stompers. Alright, alright, I get it. Storm is trivial, Storm is negative, Storm burn your house, Storm beat your mother. But, is it really fair? to bear Stomp just because we don't truly understand it. What does Stomp really stand for? Straits Times Online Mobile Print. S-T-O-M-P. Isn't it clever? It is just so clever. Well played, pretty editor lady. Very clever. But what I meant was, what is Stomp's editorial policy? Does Stomp even have one? Stomp is committed to putting every single thing up. It's something that we've said repeatedly. Mm, fair enough, but what about all the stuff we don't care about? Huh? Similar, eh? Pochap, chap, pochap, mochap, mochap. The really disappointing thing is we call this news. So. Yes, it may be a small perspective, a narrow perspective, um, as it is practiced in Singapore, say, uphold, as opposed to you know, some of the citizen journalism that you might see uh, in the US uh, right now. We don't quite have it yet, but um, it's fine. We're part of the process. This is where it starts. This is where it starts. We've become smart and sensible Singaporeans who make bright and intelligent comments because we... Because we... Nah, no, we haven't. But obviously, Storm's Don't Touch policy proves problematic. We basically moved from this... An explosion at the Marina Bay construction site. Woohoo! So yeah. To this! Yeah, I mean, that's not really fair. You can't just pick out two random articles and then say, Ah, Storm sucks. No one really edits Storm, but among all that crap, I'm sure there's got to be something good in there. Like, for example, the recent riots. You don't, you, don't, you don't see anything on the official news media, but what you get is from social media. I've got several pictures of maids uh, found cleaning the windows on the high floors, and that which actually is an effect. So there is some social value to Storm. Even amid all these negativity, all the lies, and all the way, uh, Miss Miss Lewis has Miss Lewis has something to say about the fake shit on Storm. And you know, people are cheeky. They want to test the Straits <laughs> Times to see that like, hey, will they put any darn thing up? The answer is yes, Miss Lewis. You do put any darn thing up. Yet, if Storm can be positive, do we just shut the whole thing down? No, right? But when it comes to any citizen journalism website, you would do well to remember these wise words. Gongmintita 去收集資料,花許多個月或者甚至一兩年的時間才寫出一篇文章來。總理說的有道理, we expect quality material from everyone, we expect too much, we expect to be told what to read, what to write, what to watch out for, are we really that dumb? The most important thing is that whoever are visiting such 
forums, sites and things like that, you should always take everything with a pinch of salt. And if you're intelligent enough to go on such places to read, I hope you're intelligent enough to be able to differentiate what's true, what's real, what's good, what's bad. I think the best moderator is yourself. Now, in light of all this, is Stomp really beyond saving? I would envision like a Stomp to be a website where people share all their um, like efforts to make Singapore a better place or like all their maybe environmental show, social enterprises. Like to can input more positive things to it. Lah. Any people with any better views or how we can do this better so that they can do a poll and actually make a more positive impact to the, the article itself. And it's not that difficult too. If we flood Stomp with positivity, who is there to stop us? After all, Stomp is committed to putting every darn thing up. Even typing well done and viewing more positive articles will contribute to making Stomp better all around. So why fight negativity with negativity? It doesn't really work. Why don't we all step up and make the positive difference we've all been talking about? Am I right? Huh? People such as Mr. Tan Chuan Jin and Prime Minister Lee Hsien Long, amongst others, weighing in, stressing the... Why? What's so funny? Why? I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say, but you, on a whole, you guys do not like... Yeah. Stop. Hey.